What's up, what's up, what's up? Hey, it's the NFL Guru, Doolin, and I'm back for week 11. I'm a guru now. I do it for all y'all betters and gamblers. I give you the picks, the inside. You know what I'm saying? The inside. I give it to you now. Now, you can't never say and do nothing for you. Now, we're going to start off with the first game. The Garbage Bowl. The Miami Dolphins versus the New York Jets. <laughs> yes, the Miami Dolphins versus the New York Jets. Now, by the way, uh, they already told me all, all, all the sanitation companies and all the garbage trucks are going to be parked out front in the stadium. Yeah, and, and, and if you show up to the game, you get a free garbage bag on the house. Yup, for that game. You get a free garbage bag on the house for that game. That's the Garbage Bowl. Miami Dolphins versus New York Jets. But this week, the New York Jets are going to pull it out. The, ooh, Miami know they sorry. They got some nice colors. I love their colors on their jerseys, but they sorry. Ooh, they sorry. Miami sorry. They got a lot of fans. I don't know how you got fans. I don't know. Sorry, he ain't been good in a long time. He been, they won Super Bowl, what, 73? And I, they fans ain't even, you know, alive to even, I don't, how you a Miami fan and you ain't never seen them go to Super Bowl? I don't get that, man. But anyway, Miami gonna lose this game. New York Jets gonna pull out. New York, New York Jets got a couple good quarterbacks. And Miami got some nice colors. So, I'm gonna pick the New York Jets over the Miami Dolphins. 29 to 26, the New York Jets. All right, second game we got coming up is the Baltimore Ravens versus the Chicago Bears. Now, that's gonna be a good game, you know. But this game, I'm gonna pull the Chicago Bears. Simple fact that Justin Fields is starting to get hot. He's getting real hot now. He's he, he gonna show out. You know, Ravens ain't got no defense. They ain't got. They ain't the old Ravens. They ain't got no defense at all. I, I can go out there and just run all day. They, they don't stop nobody. They're worse than the Cowboy defense last year. They, just, they don't stop nobody. They, you just run out through them. And Lamar Jackson, been, he's been having to come back every game. He's been having slow starts. But Justin Fields going to do his thing. And the, uh, Chicago, Chicago got a little bit. They ain't got too much defense. They got a little bit of defense. They can't stop the Bucks, But they got a little bit of defense. They going to stop the Baltimore Ravens. All you got to do is play that Miami defense. On, on, on Lamar now. Play that Miami defense and you're going to shut them down. The Miami shut them down. So, um, I picked I picked up Chicago Bears over the Baltimore Ravens. The score is going to be 39 to 32. All right. 39 to 32 Chicago Bears. All right. We're going to our third game. The Green Bay Packers versus the Minnesota Vikings. That ain't even really gonna be no game. You got Mr. Fascinated. He playing, and you know, he, he, he gonna do his thing. He got his favorite wide receiver, Adams. You know, so they gonna do their thing. Minnesota, I don't know why y'all even have a football team. Why y'all sign Kirk Cousins to all that money for that long? Y'all don't care about football. You sign Kirk Cousins to a long-term contract with a big, like, and, and, and big money. Kirk Cousins is garbage. He's been garbage. He's rated PG, pure garbage. Hot sanitation. How y'all got that man in y'all quarterback? He's very inconsistent and just garbage. Like, he, oh my goodness. Y'all let him start every week. Every week. I would have been having um, tryouts at, at the stadium before I put it. Man, what? Kirk Cousins? Are you serious? Y'all ain't got a chance to go nowhere. Nah. I'm going to pick the Green Bay Packers over the, the Minnesota Vikings. The score is going to be 39 to 26. All right, Green Bay. Now, next game we're going to talk about is the game of the week. The Dallas Cowboys versus the Kansas City Chiefs. Ooh, ooh that's going to be a good game. Kansas City Chiefs, they showed, they showed out last week. I think they back. They ain't good at the Bucks, but I think they back. Kansas City back. Nah, they back. They doing their thing. Kansas City back. Mahomes was throwing that rock. Why? Mahomes, he, he, he back now. You know, Cowboys defense is all right, but it ain't, it ain't no, you know, you know and, he, and Cowboys offense is good. But Mahomes going, you know, and they playing in Kansas City, you know, Dallas don't like to lead um, Cowboys Stadium, you know, and, and, and I don't know. I think Kansas City going to pull this out. I think Mahomes going to do a couple more tricks than Prescott. But it's going to be a good game with some fact that Kansas City has no defense. Anybody can score on Kansas City. 
anybody, I mean, anybody can score on Kansas City. But, I think Kansas City's gonna pull out the end. It's gonna be a high scoring game. It's gonna be 43 to 41, Kansas City over the Dallas Cowboys. That's gonna be a good game, though. That's really gonna be a good game. Uh, y'all Cowboy fans are gonna be humbled again this week. Right, y'all, y'all. I want to say one. I want to say one thing to the Cowboys real quick before I move on. I want to tell y'all congratulations. Y'all beat the, the Falcons last week. I want to say congratulations on winning the Super Bowl in November. Y'all don't know how to act. Every time y'all get a win, you think you won the Super Bowl. Anyway, congratulations for that win last week. Y'all the first team in NFL history win Super Bowl in November. All right. All right. We're gonna move on. Ain't gonna mess with the Cowboys too much. We got the game. The Pittsburgh Steelers. Versus the Chargers. The LA Chargers. Nah. That's gonna be easy win for Chargers. What's that boy, that quarterback for Pittsburgh? The one that got, I call him Denton Head. He got hit with the helmet last year by um, Garrett um, Rudy something. I call him Denton in the Head. He, got, he still got a hole in his head. He has Denton. It looked like a flat tire. Oh, he got hit right in the head. He's starting quarterback. I think um, Big Ben's still going. He, he's still out. I think he's down there. He going through mid power right now, so he ain't gonna be able to play. So and he last week he was going through mid power and he forgot what the stadium was, so he didn't get a start. But this week he out again, so they gonna let um Rudy Denton head start the game. And you know he he average, he ain't nothing spectacular. He ain't gonna you know and and and, and the Chargers got a little um behind them. They got a little um. So and it's in San Diego. I mean sorry in L.A. Nah, Chargers gonna win. 38 to 21. Chargers over the Steelers. Now, next game I'm gonna talk about is the New York Football Giants versus the Tampa Bay Buccaneers in Tampa. They ain't no New York football. They don't even be out there playing football. I don't know what. How you pick? You went for Eli Manning, one of the worst quarterbacks in the history of Giants. He won two Super Bowls. He ain't really winning the team one. To get somebody just like him and Daniel Jones, like how you, how you, I don't think they like football in New York. They just have a team because they're a big city. I don't know what they got going on, and I don't know. Y'all, you, y'all sorry every year. Y'all want a little Super Bowl, whatever. Y'all did y'all team. I ain't taking that away from you, but it's like I don't know. Anyway, they're playing in Tampa. Now you know we're the Super Bowl champions. Everybody try to show out against us every time we play, so it's gonna be a good game. In the first five minutes but we in tampa you know we're gonna show out a little bit it's on a monday night we're gonna show out you know if we like monday night we show out we want out of ike we show out on monday so bucks gonna win that game get the, the new york football giants 35 to 19. you know new york never can kick field goals they be getting the ugliest goals i don't know where they be doing Daniel jones don't throw too many touchdowns they kick foot field goals the whole game so they're gonna have like 19 points all right, Tampa Bay over the Giants. Now, my bonus game, the Cardinals versus the Seahawks. And they're playing in Seattle. You know, Seattle can't play outside of Seattle, but they're playing in Seattle with a 12-man stadium. But Seattle still ain't got nobody to throw it to. And uh, Russell is still rusty. So we're going to go ahead and, and we're going to go ahead and get that game. To the Card- Cardinals lost last week. They got whooped. They got demolished. I think they learned their lesson. They realized, dang, we ain't that good. So I think they back on their on, on their P's and Q's, and they're gonna pull this out again. Seattle can't stop nobody either. I don't know. Seattle can't stop nobody. They they used to have that great defense. Nah, they they it's like they invisible. Like if people just be running all through them and around them, and it's like I'm like, are they even out there? I don't even be seeing them. I be like, Seattle ain't got no players on the on the field, but they really do. They just be invisible. But the Cardinals are gonna win this game. They're going back on their P's and Q's. They got a little nice little offense. They got a nice look. They ain't betting the Bucks though. But they got a nice little offense. Nice little offense. I say the Cardinals are gonna win. 36 to 28. Cardinals. Now, that was your picks. From the guru now. Don't never say I ain't look out for you. Go ahead and put your money up. Put your money up. You're going to win you some money, I'm telling you. Get it from the guru. All right, y'all. Y'all be safe, be easy till next week.